What is up, YouTube? How you guys doing today? Woohoo! Man, I gotta tell you what, guys. I am so glad. I am so glad to be on the bike. I'm riding a motorcycle. Woo! I'm on the bike. Hi! Look at me! Look at me! I'm on a motorcycle! <laughs> Okay, so I've got two lessons for you guys who are motovloggers. Numero uno is this. Whenever you go out, it doesn't matter how short it is, it doesn't matter how long it is, if you're on that motorcycle and you're a motovlogger, you better be filming. And here is why. A long, long time ago, about four score and seven and a half minutes ago, um, I went uh, diving with some friends of mine on their boat. And I have many GoPro housings, one of which is the one with the back, the little floaty thing. You guys know what I'm talking about. It's like giant orange. So, it's if you drop it in the water, guess what? It doesn't sink! So my dumbass decides that I'm going to put my head strap on and do some, some diving. And lo and behold, which GoPro housing did I use? Not the one with the orange one, that's for damn sure. And uh, I certainly didn't use a regular GoPro housing. No, 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 no. I had to use the Cena backpack GoPro housing, which by the way, also had my Cena backpack in it. So of course, as soon as I did the backflip off the boat, yeah, now my GoPro is sitting at the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> so in about 10 years, when that shit washes up the shore, because it'll still be good in that GoPro housing, someone's gonna get a badass camera with some really cool footage. <laughs> You know, it wasn't even about the, the GoPro itself. I mean, we can always buy more GoPros. It's just money. But it was the footage, right? It was that memory. And unfortunately, uh, I lost all that stuff. So the next day, I, I ordered it. But, of course, the Cena backpack and the, uh, the, the new GoPro took, like, almost two weeks to get here. However, you guys would never have known that, right? Because I've been posting all my videos, and I do four a week. Two of them for motor vlogs. Yeah, so I have been stocking up footage just in case because you just never know. Who knows? Maybe, God forbid, you get into an accident. Maybe your job schedule changes and you can't really ride. Maybe it's raining like hell. Maybe it's winter time. I don't know. I'm not a weatherman. But shit happens. So there you go. There are two lessons in that. Number one, always, always, always be filming. And then number two, if you're gonna go out on the water, get the stupid orange floaty. So you know, I have a ton of people that I follow and subscribe to, and I religiously watch their videos all the time. I always try to make sure that I comment and I always like it and, and this and that. But there's one particular guy that I'll give a quick little shout out to is Fry Riding, who also shot me out the other day on a video, which was so cool. I ended up getting like 30 something subscribers off that little shout out. So rock on, dude. Thank you so much. So for those of you who do not know who Fry Riding is, make sure you go over to his channel. You can just subscribe to his channel, tell him I said what's up. Okay, so the reason why I bring up Fry Riding is because. He did something in one of his videos called uh, the something motovloggers you've never seen before, or maybe you have. I don't know. I'm not a psychic. So I'm actually going to do the same thing because these two guys, I highly recommend. They are some of the funniest guys out there. They're just getting started. They have the best content, honestly, guys. Uh, I, I feel like I've got some pretty good content, but man, these guys just trump me. They are fantastic. So, the two people that I want to shout out today are J Fiverr Rides. He is unbelievable. One of the cool things I love about his videos is that, do you guys remember back in the day when uh, you had the, oh god, it was the, the Street Fighter game. I can't remember the name of it. Maybe it was actually called Street Fighter. I don't know. But you got to pick your avatar, right? Okay, so he does that at the beginning. So he's got like two or three different avatars that pops up on the screen next to his motorcycle. And eventually, he's got the sound effects with it too. So eventually he picks one and it does like the power up sound effect and he goes off on a ride. Seriously, it is so cool. Uh, the guy is, he is funny as hell and he's got some kick-ass content. So J5 rides, you fucking rock, dude. And I, I, you deserve so many more subscribers than you have already. Numerous. All right, the next guy is 
is Hunter Honda. Now, Fry Riding is the one that shouted him out. I checked out his channel, and I swear to God, his nine minute video he just posted, I could not stop laughing. It was so fucking funny. And now I'm hooked. I'm watching every single one of his videos. Uh, he's only got a hundred and like one subscribers, guys. We need to help this dude out. He is fucking cool as shit. He's got uh, just the greatest content. I, I, it's so hard to explain. You just gotta go watch it. It is so cool. You know what? I actually have a third one that I wanna shout out because he also shouted out me and I love his content. Uh, this is a guy that every time he posts, I have to watch his video. I have to watch it all the way through. And his name is The Spiky Biker. The guy is from UK. Uh, Fry Riding actually shouted him out too, but he deserves it. Um, I think he's got a thousand something subscribers. Uh, he's so cool. He's a very nice guy, and he's funny as hell. So go watch those three guys. So J Fiber Rides, Hunter Honda, and uh, the Spiky Biker, and I will make sure I have all of the descriptions listed below in the comments section. All right, this is gonna be a long lane split. Holy shit, and I don't think I can get through there, can I? I think I can. Yes, I can. Lane splitting is fun. Lane splitting is fun. I think I lane split a cop. I think I might be getting a ticket for that one. I don't care. I'll pay it. Hey, pull over! Pull over! Pull over! I want to talk to you! Pull over! camera. You see that? You don't want to talk? I want to talk to you. What? Non fucking believable, man. Some fucking people. I kind of want to follow him and like when he pulls over, I'm going to talk to his ass. I don't know. Maybe I'll get a light up here and I'll talk to him. We're on the window. Why would you honk at me? Lane splitting, listen, lane filtering is this. Look, lane filtering is the safest way for a motorcycle to get through traffic. That's all I'm saying. It's safer. Why? Whatever. That just goes to show you, ladies and gentlemen. There's some ignorant, nasty fucking people out there. And look, that's the cop that I lane split right there. He didn't give a shit. Unbelievable. So, this concludes another fantastic saga from Jasper Chase and the Chase Jasper Down YouTube channel. Stay tuned next week to win a brand new car. Oh, wait, 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 no, no Mr. Announcer guy. Uh, nobody is winning a brand new car. I, I, I can't do that. Well, seems like it's a pretty good idea. Yeah, but you, Mr. Announce Guy, you don't understand. I don't have the money to buy a car for somebody. Well, if you're done with me, I'm gonna go do blow off a hooker's ass. Dude, seriously, what the fuck is wrong with you?